I got approached by Doug Moradian of PCMA East Glendale here in, near Los Angeles, and he, myself, and Bob Konoski of, of course, at Structures LA, met and started structuring a studio with the ambition to actually make it a joint engineering and architecture studio. And uh, this was three years ago. So this is the third year we're running this studio. This is also the first year we're running this studio as a joint engineering and architecture studio, which means we have engineering students, undergrad and grad, joint with undergrad and grad architecture students working on a project. And we have also a faculty from civil engineering advising and, and monitoring. Well, the first year we started out looking at, at actually at some, a, a local issue, which is public transportation, which is absent for our students. Uh, we are mostly commuter university. And the next year we followed up on a call of the president to demolish one of our iconic buildings on campus. And I took the opportunity, again, like focusing on the, on the issue of commuter college and environmentally sentient uh, kind, that we have to provide student and faculty housing on campus. This year, we through the joint agenda, we, uh, we focused also structures much more than we have previously. Uh, we decided we are looking at current events realized that there is a niche for the Precast Concrete Society to look into tsunami evacuation facilities. The West Coast of, of Southern California, Oregon, and Washington is technically an impact zone for tsunamis. We received actually extensive support in, in uh, information material and tours to facilities and workshops from, particularly from course of structures in LA. Uh, but there have also been to Clark Pacific, which is one of their facilities in Fontana. Doug Moradian has been fundamental in, in coming into uh, into studio, giving talks on precast concrete, on the history, on the technology of it. We also have members, uh, we had also uh, kind of like breakout sessions with the engineers of some of the facilities, sat down with our students, discussed kind of like the fundamental thinking problems or actually agenda for precast concrete in comparison to architectural agendas. And so all in all, it was very close and tight collaboration between the, the industry and us. And of course, they also, I always initiated or allowed to have the industry also uh, input on the way we write our syllabi. Studio gained more and more traction over the last two years. And this year, I had to actually reject some students to take part in the studio. Such a great dynamic in the studio right now and high collaboration. And there's actually literally friendships going on now between engineering and architecture. This is a fantastic program and I'm, I'm hoping that this will continue and, and spread over, over different universities.